Hey guys, Scrappy Case 2. Got another D stash for you. Um, all right. This one's sort of all over the place, I guess. <laughs> um, so let me just start. Let me turn this. So where I can see what I'm doing. Alright. Oh, I got a bunch of stamps here. Okay. First of all, I got a uh, Distress Ink Iced Spruce for $3. Uh, I accidentally got two of them. And this is actually one that I had um, gotten from somebody else. So um, that's $3 for that. And some Inca Dinka Do Christmas stamps. Um, these are, let's see, they're all, yeah, they're all Inca Dinka, well, except for this last one. These are going to be $4. Here's the first one. The first one is called um, Large Flourishes. Okay, and the next one is Winter Silhouettes. Alright, and this one is Winter Borders. Okay. And then this one is an American Crafts stamp called Missile Bow. <laughs> Missile Bow. Alright, and this one's $4. Alright. And then I have a Stampin' Up um, set. Crud, I forgot. Oh, tags and more. This is five dollars. Never been used. It's been. Yeah, they put it. It must have been. I don't know if it came like that already on the. Um, the um, blocks or. Yeah, I don't know. Okay, so $5 for that. And then I have another Stampin' Up, but there's, that I got in a, um, an auction that apparently is missing a couple of, of pieces. It's the, uh, Stampin' Up Fabulous Flourishes, which I don't know why in the world they called it that. These are the stamps that are in there. These are, I printed out a, a picture of what's supposed to be in there and the ones that are missing is this one and this one these two right here so I was just gonna ask like two bucks for this if anybody wants it alright and then I have some Stamper's Best um, deep red stamps. This one is three dollars. This one's called Wishing You. This one is Floral Corsage Dress. This is four dollars. And then this one is Iron Scroll Pear. This is four dollars. Then I have a stray die. <laughs> it's a cherry land die. Fanciful flourishes. It's five dollars. Okay. And then I have wooden stamps. I don't know if anybody's interested um, in these. I still got some of the other wooden stamps left from my last D stash. Um, this one. Um, is a dollar uh, dollar 
Um, I guess just if you want it to, well, I'll put it down in the description um, in the order that I put them in, so um, you'll know which one it is. But this one's musical, I guess. I'm just put a dollar on that. This one is smile, finest smile ever, dollar. Tweet, tweet, dollar. This is a um, bell border, two dollars. Uh, butterfly, three dollars. Flourish, three dollars. Ho, 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 dollar. And happy holidays, dollar. And tis the season, three dollars. Numbers, three dollars. And this one is... Um, don't have a name, but I'll just call it, um, I'll just call it Trees, four dollars. Butterfly Flourish, four dollars. And this is a background stamp, uh, Circles, five dollars. Okay, and then I'm going to have some, there's my little bucket, I'm going to put all my stamps in there. Alright, and then I have this bag, I don't know if anybody's going to want this or not, but I'm just putting it out there. Um, again, stuff I find in auctions that comes with other stuff and I don't really want it. So this has got, like if you were um, back in the 80s, and I guess 80s, when you were doing your walls, painting your walls with that rag technique and all that kind of stuff. Um, this has got some cheesecloth, which I know that us crafters use cheesecloth and I've got plenty so I'm, I'm putting this out there. And then this one is a rag rolling cotton and then in, there's some sponges in here these and I know we could probably use these in crafting too but I don't so um, I was just gonna two bucks for this bag if anybody wants it okay and then um, I had this big tub of foam winter things, stickers, um, and I've probably had it for a while, and I've probably dug into that thing one time. Um, so I kind of divided it up. Um, this has got all of the um, letters in it. They've got snowflakes on them. And there are different shades of blue. Okay. And then these two bags are the same. Um, they, they got different kinds of um, snowflakes in them. And some little characters. A bear, penguin, and a snowman. So if you want all these, uh, it's $4 for that. Okay. And... Then I was going to mention, uh, I forgot to put it in my last de-stash for the remaining de-stashes. I still have this um, trimmer, this uh, Fiskars trimmer uh, that doesn't have the blade in it. Uh, I lost the blade. It's a good trimmer. All you got to do is just put a new blade in it. And um, I forget what I asked for it, so I'll put the price down in the description when I look at my list. But there's that. Okay. And then I have two lot bags. 
All right. The first one is going to have a couple of stamps in it. These are uh, Valentine, probably an Easter. Okay. Plus, I put some. Um, these are. This is a fabric ribbon, and I really love this ribbon. I've got a lot of it, and it's like got this cool pattern on it. And then this one's a grow grain black, and this is a um, fabric as well. It, it's a different kind of fabric. It's not. It's not like your clothes fabric. It's it's something else. I don't know the name of it, but anyway, there's that. And then I've got some ribbons in here, some Christmas ribbons. I don't know how much is on there. I just wound it up and put it in here. <laughs> um, I've used probably this green one before. There's a bunch of that in there, but it's really pretty. It's got some gold um flex in there I don't know not flex whatever you call that <laughs> and hold on just one second hold on all right um, sorry about that this is the next one really shiny um, with more shininess in it okay and then here's one Here's how much. Here's a uh, velvet one. Uh, it's that deep red and gold. And here's another one. Okay. I'm going to have a wreath in here. Make you a little wreath for Christmas. And I put those, uh, I think at one time I had these on a D stash. Um, and I still had them, so I put them in this bag. So it's the um, Prima Got Flowers, or <laughs> it's Prima Flowers, and it's just the brown color. They're full, I hadn't even opened it. Okay. And then, nobody wanted these either, so. If I'm selling them with this, with this lot, so I hope this is something you'd want to. It's these pony beads. <laughs> I figure because they're so heavy, in order for shipping not to be outrageous and just to have it by itself, I would put it with some stuff, um, so that you know it wouldn't cost an arm and a leg. So um, this lot. Um, this lot's going to be um, $13 shipped, and if I can fit anything else in there, I may just throw it in the bag with the rest of the stuff. Um, all of this stuff is kind of weird shaped, and as far as shipping, this is the cheapest So in this um, 680 bag, so I'm trying to get as much in there that would be feasible for you as a some as somebody buying to to get it so let's see I may not be able to get too much more but I could probably find something all right so that one's 13 shipped all right the next one I don't know yet hold on a second I got two stamps in here. It's a Hello stamp and a Chevron stamp. All right, and I got the other re another wreath in here. And I have this. And I have this tape, which is uh, ABC. It's not washi tape. It's um. I don't know. Let's see. It's I think it's I think it's clear, but hold on, let me see. No, it's not clear. It's got the white background with the the um 
ABC is written. You know, that thing that you all used to see on the, the top of the, the very top of the blackboard, you would see your ABCs written the way they're supposed to be written. That's what this looks like. But it's, it's tape. It's not really washy, but it's, it's kind of neat for school, for any school layouts or cards for teachers or gifts for teachers. Okay, and then I have this, um, this is a little kit, a wire kit, I don't know what you call it, um, it's a flower, it's to show, it's to help, uh, it's for you to do a flower in wire. I'm not sure how many, um, I don't really see a whole lot of wire, um, embellishments, um, that people do now I do see some like Christmas time um, I've got a few that I think Hobby Lobby sold like the words hope or something like that in wire but the this will show you how to do you know around the corners and all that kind of stuff so not really sure what it's called a wire kit <laughs> all right and then I have a little bag of, um, this is a boa. I just saw a, I just saw a video yesterday or the day before of somebody using a boa to make a wreath. So that might be good for this wreath here. But it was a Halloween boat. It was a Halloween wreath. Um, this one is in two parts. So, um see that <laughs> it's soft um, so you may can use this for a Halloween wreath or something and then I have a bag of little pom-poms in color color pom-poms in different sizes all right and I also have a bag of craft sticks popsicle sticks is what you call I guess but uh, I've said this before I use these for making uh, fences. You can make a snowman. I just saw a video on that. Um, you can look up on Yahoo, not Yahoo, on a YouTube, and you'll find a lot of, um, especially kids' crafts, but you'll find a lot of crafts uh, using these. Um, I use these for the bottoms of my flowers sometimes, and uh, like I said, making fences, so that'd be good. And let's make this one. This one's 13 as well. Um, shit. And again, I may, if I can shove anything else in here, I'll do that. Um, oh, and I have one more thing that I need y'all to help me figure out. I have a die here that I don't know the name of it. It's this one. I thought it was called Button Border, but um, it's... I don't think that's it. I don't know. Um, but I've used it before. And it's like you cut this out and maybe put some paper back here and put buttons on it in different sizes. And that's what I did right here. It was a, a Christmas layout that I was going to put it on. I put like a, um, a little present button right there and all that. So um, I don't know what it's called. Um, and I can't find it so um, I'm just gonna ask if you want this I'm just gonna ask you three dollars for that okay and I think that is it for now don't forget to look at my last D stash uh, I did I put it up late at night so some of you may not have seen it um, and if you have any questions about anything, let me know. And that's it. And uh, we'll talk to you guys later. Thanks. Bye.